Hello there, a couple of things to update you on this week. I was interviewed by Radio 4's Today programme, so you can have a listen to that uh, through the link on our website. They wanted to talk about how our hospitals have been coping with the Omicron variant of Covid, which I'm glad to say is now falling away, but also to hear about the excellent work and innovation that our surgical teams have delivered to try to cope with the backlog that that's created. So do have a listen to that. I also visited a number of our services, including radiology with Dr Al Syed, visited our emergency department with Alwyn Williams, the Chief Executive of Arts, and Jackie Smith, our Joint Chair, to see some of the innovation and work that's on the way down there to deal with the pressure on the front door. And also had a walk around with Moses from Sodexo. They're the people that provide food for our patients and our staff here at Queen's Hospital. And it was interesting hearing their experiences, including the housekeeping staff, the food preparation staff and what they've been doing alongside us through the pandemic to make sure that both patients and staff have been well looked after and have been able to come to work in a clean and well-run hospital. And finally, I just wanted to acknowledge that a number of our staff took part in a protest outside the hospital on Friday to raise their concerns about the mandatory vaccine programme and the impact it might have on some of them, but also how it feels for them to be part of this mandatory programme. And um, I have to say that the staff conducted themselves well and made their point in a very respectful and dignified manner and thank you to everyone at the hospital who was involved in making sure that that passed off peacefully and that the message was seen and heard by many thousands of people over the course of the day. Hope you all have a good week. Thank you.